All right, we are back with the Liverpool career mode. So we got some pretty big games in this episode. We are going to be finishing the month of September. We have Southampton away, and then we have Arsenal away, and then Dortmund in the Champions League. So those are going to be the three played games in this episode. We're going to sim the other three. So Southampton, a team we should beat, and then Arsenal and Dortmund. These two games are going to be our biggest test of the season so far, and also a test for our sliders. But before we get into this Southampton game, we are going to jump into this episode's press conference. All right, so first comment, sign Coutinho and give him back his role at Liverpool an epic return a lot of you guys want us to re-sign Coutinho in the series which is kind of surprising I also saw someone say that we should sign a uh, Suarez back I mean hey if enough of you guys want to see it I have no problem in us re-signing Coutinho I don't think it would be that expensive even though right now we don't have the funds for it so if we sell someone before January we can maybe sign him in the January transfer window maybe we'll see all right next one sign Sabitz or Basuma as they're linked to Liverpool in our realistic transfers now I would have signed Basuma but he was a big part of our Newcastle save so I don't want to sign like the same player that we already used a lot. Sabitzer though, he would be a good pickup. So it looks like he's gone to Atletico Madrid. So maybe in the future we can take a look at him, but I've never used him in any career mode. So that would be an interesting signing. All right, next one, will you do another season? So will we be doing another season with Liverpool a season two? Pretty much that depends on what you guys want to see. You guys want to see a season two? We will do a season two. Otherwise this could be just a one season career mode that we move on to a different team. And then last one, will we ever do a master league with a premier league team? So yeah, we have the Barcelona master league going right now. I don't know how long that's going to last. We're in season two. I don't know if we'll do a season three or a season two will be the end. But yeah, I think our next Pez Master League after Barcelona will be a Premier League team. Because with PC mods, I mean, every Premier League team has a stadium. We have all the scoreboards. Everything looks perfect. So I definitely want to do that in the future. So drop a like on this video if you are enjoying this series. And we are going to jump into this Southampton game. All right, so it looks like Fabinho is not fully fit for this game. I am going to try Trent in the midfield. We are doing it. Henrix gets his debut as well. I'm just so curious to see how Trent plays in the midfield on this game. Because if you look at his stats, he looks like such a good midfielder. So we're going to try that in this game. So we had a shaky start to the season in episode one. Episode two, we corrected that with two wins. Let's see if that carries over into episode three. I didn't even realize that my shirt is matching the actual Liverpool away kit as well. That was not planned, but we're going to act like it was. Yeah, once again, I took another break from FIFA. I've not played FIFA in probably like four days. That should not be enough to where uh, we lose, but you never know. We're going to see what happens. Happens. Hopefully we can get this win here and then move on to Arsenal, which I think that is going to be a much, much tougher game. Already, that's a good ball through to Sadio Mane. Going to try to get people in the box. That was not terrible. It's going to go back out to Mane. Okay, no, it's not. That header was won by, uh, I think it was Walker Peters. Trent going to get that to Firmino. That was supposed to go to Salah. It goes to Mane instead, and that is the first goal seven minutes in. That is a good start. I mean, that through ball was meant for Salah, but uh, thankfully it switched to Mane. That was supposed to go to Salah. Salah ran into Vestigard, I think. All right, Sadio Mane, that is towards our objective as well. Maybe we can get some assists with uh, Trent since he's playing more up forward now. But that is a very good start to this game. 1-0 up already. Like I said, this episode is going to be a big test for these sliders. Depending on how we do, we might change them for uh, the next episode. But we'll see after these uh, these three games in this episode. It's a good ball to Tiago. I realize uh, Tiago doesn't have the best stamina in this game. So hopefully that does not hinder his performance. Vestigard, what did I just see? What did I actually just see? What just happened? I'm not even sure that what I saw was actually what I saw. I got to see it again. So we do not go for the shot. It's deflected. Vestigard. Vestigard with the finish of the season. Vestigard thought he was playing as a front nine right here for some reason and just heads it into his own goal. FIFA, FIFA, what are you doing? What are you doing? That might be the worst own goal I've ever seen the CPU commit in any, any FIFA. Oh my, 14 minutes in, two nil up off a goal like that. How is that even possible? Like what just happened? They need to throw Vestigard up front after that. That was the craziest thing I've seen the CPU do in so long. Now they might get one back and they do get one back. There's the clean sheet. Yeah, that 25 clean sheet objective is gonna be pretty tough. I feel like on these sliders. I feel like I could have done better there. Yeah, that turn by Adams was just Pretty, pretty darn good. All right, that cancels out Vestigard's goal. So now we're back to a one goal lead. A weird start to this episode. Gonna give that to Trent. Gonna give that to Firmino. Trent. Can you play it to Salah? That's actually a good ball. A very good ball. Salah, can we try and get a shot away for that assist? Maybe not. Gonna go to Mane. That ball was horrendous. Virgil still has it back though. All right. Trent to Salah. Firmino. 
Tiago, Mane, where are you at? Oh, that ball from Tiago was so good. That must be a goal, and that is a goal. All right, that is that is four goals total in 25 minutes. Two for Mane. This might be a high-scoring episode. I think it was uh, Tiago with the assist. That was such a good turn. Mane's third goal in the Premier League, and we're 3-1 up. Two-goal lead is restored. This time, it's us scoring in Alvestigard. We are just going to try to keep piling these on, I guess, and Trent could not get that shot away. He does not feel like a right back playing in the, in the midfield, though. He definitely feels like a midfielder. That pass was crazy. Any Ings back towards Prowse. I just left Ings. I just left Ings, and that's why they scored. All right, I cannot be making these mistakes. I just can't, especially against Southampton. Yeah, I, I just completely left Danny Ings. All right, 2-3. Five goals in the first half. This is, this is quite the game. Firmino gonna get that to Trent. Our attack is kind of slow right now. Firmino, can you get to that? No, you can't. All right, maybe one more attack before this uh, first half is over. Salah, can you win that? Yes, you can. Firmino. Okay, this is like a carbon copy chance. Thiago just can't get the ball to Mane this time. All right, and that is the first half. So 2-3, two, three, or 3-2 three, for us. That is five goals. We'll see if that continues in the second half. A good ball to Henriks. This looks like a decent chance. Trent gonna play in Firmino. Firmino, can you do this all yourself, maybe? Can you do this yourself? Gonna square it. Trent's there, and Trent is gonna put that in. All right, with the way I'm defending, that feels good to get a two-goal lead. How about that? Trent scoring from the midfield. Like I said, he does not feel like he's playing out of position at all. Literally, his only bad stat in this game is uh, like 59 finishing, I think, and he just scored. So 60th minute, 4-2. Now, can we not concede any more, any more goals? And that's a good steal by Trent. A very good ball to Genepo. Can Van Dyke make the tackle? No, he can't. Man, my defending feels so shaky right now, but that was a good tackle. All right, Jota will be coming on for Firmino, Rashica for uh, Mane, and then we are going to get Tielemans on for Thiago. Can we score another goal before that? Trent is in. Trent is in. That is that is the slowest finish ever, but Trent has two goals in this game. All right, so I think Trent Alexander-Arnold in the midfield. Not bad. It's not bad at all. All right, subs on. That should be game in all three points. Just have to see out this last 15 minutes. And uh, we're going to get that to Trent on a hat trick. Going to try and shoot one. Why not? But it's straight at McCarthy. And oh, into Tielemans. Trent, I was looking for Trent on the hat trick. I saw that run. That was beautiful. Yeah, Trent has, I didn't think he'd be this good in the midfield. He's actually so good. Can he get an assist? Oh, that ball is just not quite good enough. Can we get one final attack? And yes, we can. Salah is in. Salah is going to finish that for six goals in this game total for us. Salah did not have that good of a game, but he finishes it off with a goal. I think it was uh, Jota with the assist, I'm pretty sure. All right, six goals in the first game of this episode. Not bad, even though the defending needs to be a bit better. But 6-2 win, that is not bad. Not bad at all. All right, so first Champions League game against Rene. They're probably the third best team in our group. So we're going to play the Dortmund game, so we're going to sim this one. So Jota comes in, Telemans comes in, and also Matip comes in. We still should win this game, no problem, and it's going to be a only a 1-1 draw. All right, that is kind of kind of disappointing. Seven shots, only one goal for us. That is a that is a typical Liverpool performance. All right, next game is Villa at home in the Premier League. This should easily be a win. We're playing our full strength first team, and it's going to be a 3-2 win. So defense still not looking that good, but Hendo, Firmino, and Mane score. All right, so now we got Arsenal in the EFL Cup, which I'm not too worried about, but it will be nice if we can move on and not lose to Arsenal. And we lose to Arsenal on pens. All right, I mean, EFL Cup, not that important. Plus, I think they fielded a uh, more first team rather than us. We played a complete second team pretty much, but it's all right. We're not worried about the EFL Cup uh, too much. More about the Champions League and the Premier League. All right, so now we got Arsenal at the Emirates in the Premier League. So they have Romanoli, they have Modric, two interesting signings, and we're going to see what we can do at Arsenal away from home. Probably one of our biggest tests so far, especially with these sliders. All right, Luka Modric, former Spurs player, playing for Arsenal. That makes sense. We are going to see what we can do in this game, see if our high-scoring form from the Southampton game carries over into this game. This time, we do have the regular first team, though, so the midfield trio is our usual. That pass was not very good by uh, Henderson. A good ball to Firmino. Mane. Mane was almost in. I think he was in. thought he was offside, but okay, Fabinho. That is such a good tackle. See if we can try to do this again. I'm gonna go back to Thiago. Salah, I need you to make a run. That is the run that I was looking for, but Tierney is a pretty good left back. Go to Mane to Henderson. Back to Mane. I don't even know what I just tried. I think I pressed the wrong... Uh, shooting button and that's gonna go right back to Gomez. This game feels pretty open to uh to start out. Get that to Mane. See Trent. Oh I was supposed to go to Trent. I pressed the wrong button. Salah 
Can you get a shot away still? No, you can't. Okay, Tierney is locking up solid to start this game. It's also my fault. Just a little bit, though. Just a little bit. My defending needs to be a lot better. I cannot leave players. Hendo, it's an unfortunate tackle. Modric can shoot. Not a bad shooter of the ball at all. That's a good through ball. And Allison makes such a big save. Yeah, that was some good passing. I don't even know what I could have done better there. Corner is going to be swung in. And this is kind of awkward. But we do get the ball out. So let's see if we can break out here. Looks like we can. Firmino gonna hit Sadio Mane, take it forward, gonna be unselfish to Mohamed Salah, and that is a typical Liverpool counterattack goal. Mane, Salah, the counterattack is deadly. Beautifully executed, beautiful finish from Salah, and we are 1-0 up. 33 minutes. Okay, okay, every time the CPU kicks off, they always try a little pass like that, and it never works. Why do they do that? It makes no sense. But they do look threatening when they're coming forward, though, so I'm a little bit nervous. Okay. I just brought Robertson so far out. We are just going to clear that, though. Defending was not horrible in the end. All right, Firmino, can we counterattack again? Salah, do you have the beating of Tierney? Not quite. We try and work this around a bit. All right, back to Salah. Beautiful. Beautiful. Oh, that's so beautiful. That is, that is beautiful. The give and go between Salah and Hendo. And we have a 2-0 lead now. Both off counterattacks. Yeah, it's pretty much Thomas Partey losing the ball in their half. And we just have the speed and the ability to counterattack. Five goals for Salah already in the Premier League. And we're 2-0 up. Probably going into halftime 2-0 up. I mean, we could maybe get one more attack in, maybe. Looks like we can. Firmino, it's not a great ball, and that is going to be halftime. Right, so, 2 0 up. We'll see if we can keep this clean sheet. But we are not in bad shape here. Not in bad shape at all. On a little give and go with Firmino, maybe. It's actually a good ball. There's no one in the box, though, just yet. Going to play that to Tiago. I wanted to take a shot right there outside the box. Firmino, Tiago, do a little turn. Give that to Hendo. Firmino, not in a bad spot. Not in a bad spot. Flip that to Tiago, the header. Can't quite get to it. All right, game is kind of slowed down in the second half a little bit. But we are 2-0 up, so we are just trying to see this out. This does not look like a bad attack. Not like a bad attack at all. Just that final shot. Can't get it off. Oh, let's keep the clean sheet. Keep it, please. Keep it. Van Dyke blocks that. Allison, grab it. Grab it. Good, good, good. I think we only have one clean sheet this season. We need to keep this one. Endo will be coming off pretty soon for Tielemans. Salah looks like he is kind of in here. It's a decent spot for a shot. Leno is there for it, though. Yeah, it feels like we have recovered so much from that first episode. I feel like we are playing so, so, so much better. It's a good ball. Firmino. Oh, that is so good. Can we put in the remote? No, we can't. That passing was so good. I don't know how we didn't finish that. All right, subs on. Three minutes left. This looks like it will be another three points for us pretty easily. Arsenal not putting up that much of a fight, especially in the second half. This second half has been so slow. I do not mind a slow second half when we have a 2-0 lead. So we might get one final chance. Maybe Trend can swing it across. It's not bad. Not looking bad at all. Milner Milner gets to it, and Leno has to save it. Not aiming for Milner. I was aiming for a Jota up front. Trent with the corner. That is that is going to be cleared out to Trent. Can we get one more cross in? Ref blows the whistle. Maybe not, but that is a 2-0 win. And so like I said, it feels like we have recovered completely from that first episode. So two wins and played games to start this episode. But now we have Dortmund. That now is our biggest test this season so far. All right, so Dortmund in the Champions League up next. As you can see, we all drew our first game. So that draw against Rene was actually not that bad. So a win here would put us in first. So they still have Sancho, still have Holland. Pretty much a regular Dortmund side other than Azpilicueta playing right back. It looks like the only change. But yeah, biggest test of this season so far the series so far we are gonna see what we can do against Dortmund in the Champions League all right Liverpool and Dortmund games are usually pretty exciting so biggest test so far in this series at home we're gonna see if we can get our first win in the Champions League this season all right, Robertson is gonna go on a run here down the line can't see because the uh the roster little lineup thing is scrolling I'm gonna try to cross that in I don't even know what's happening all right we're gonna slow this down a little bit Fabinho Good first touch into Thiago. That was supposed to go to Henderson. He was supposed to make a run. Mane up to Jota, who was starting over for Mino due to fitness in this game. Hendo, that was not a good pass to Salah. Ball out to Mane. Can we spring for a counterattack? Just like the Arsenal game. It's not going to look like we're going to beat Witzel. And that pass was cut out easily by Azpilicueta. It's so weird to see him playing in a Dortmund kit. Right, Salah to Henderson. Salah is going to go on a run. Not a bad ball. Can we aim for someone in the box? Jota, where are you at? He did not want to go for that cross for uh, for some reason. It's been a cagey, cagey start, though. 
Jota, I see you. I don't know where to go with this. Their defense is actually pretty, pretty wide open. That was a decent shot by Thiago. It's just saved by Berkey. You're not doing too bad, though. Just passing a little bit more crisp, and we can create a better chance. Good ball to Thiago. This Thiago Mane combination has been working Mane hits the post that was that would have been such a nice looking goal so far holland not really a threat just yet as i say that jules has a lot of space to cross this ball in but uh decides against it probably for good reason because witzel is in a better spot now they're gonna go right back to jules are they gonna do anything with this they do van dyke gets the block in okay sala i kind of see you i kind of see you Kind of see you on the volley, not the cleanest of volley, but we had to go for that. All right, second half begins, still nil-nil. Feels like a pretty tight game, even though chances are not really, like, there's not clear, clear chances yet. See if we see some in the rest of this game. All right, Sancho has Holland to cross to, does not want to, though. CPU in this game just never wants to cross the ball. Witzel, Hendo trying to mark, and I just ran right through the ball, I think. Goes back to Emery Chan. He can, he can definitely shoot, and that is a good steal by Kanate, and we're going to slow this down just a little bit. Okay, I passed it, and it switched to Allison. We eventually do get the ball out. Now, Trent going to try to play a ball. That is quite the ball out to Thiago. Now, can we whip this right back in? Mane, oh, I don't even know what just happened. That looked like a attempt at something real, real special. Jota, Thiago, such a good ball to Mane. Is he on side? Gonna cross it into Salah, and that is off target. I meant for that to be a low cross. Yeah, that, that should have been a goal. Either way. Okay, Holland. I don't know why no one's marking him. Royce, Kanate, that is such a good block. That is such a good block. Now we win this ball. Okay, that should give us momentum a little bit. Mane, just get on your bike. Get on your bicycle. What do we even aim for here? We're going to slow this down. Try and play that to Jota. That's going to be a corner. All right, Firmino is going to come on for Jota. I feel like he might give us that goal. And then uh, Tielemans is on for Henderson because his fitness is not looking too good. We're going to try swinging this corner in a little bit deeper. It's not exactly what I wanted, but that actually almost works. That should have worked. That header was so weak from Mane. I've never seen a header so weak. Good ball to Thiago. Is he offside, Firmino? No, he's not. Not offside, Firmino. Oh, I thought he gave us the goal. I thought that was going to be a super sub. Oh, how do we not finish that? How do we not finish that? All right, come on. It's there for us. Feel it. The momentum is switched that is not the cross i wanted at least we get a corner out of it i didn't even know what else to do with it really i want to take this short but we also do have van dyke right there i'm gonna try to aim for him goes to mane again zagadu is gonna beat mane every day of the week trent we're gonna go to t elements back to trent what do we even do here i kind of want to get a shot away but like there's just no room and i know every shot gets blocked t elements Telemans, get the shot away, and Telemans off the bench gives us the lead. 83rd minute, that could be the possible winner. I think that's his first goal for Liverpool as well. Yeah, we have, we've had the momentum for quite some time. Just could not find that pass, and that was a very good pass and a very good finish. Man, Firmino has been so good in the series so far. That's another assist for him. He has been scoring and assisting like crazy. Now, all I gotta do is keep this lead for five minutes, and this will be a very, very big win. All right, two added minutes. That is it. That is it. They might get one final chance at attacking Royce Firmino 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 makes the tackle maybe not yes he does and okay, that should be it and that is gonna be it they don't even get a shot all right that is a slim one no win but I feel like we had the momentum for most of the second half so it feels deserved that is a that is a huge huge win especially at home it was a game that we needed to win all right so that sees us heading into the month of October so in the next episode we have Man City that is going to be huge. And also Chelsea away. That's going to be huge as well. So two very, very tough games. I feel like the sliders are at like a decent spot right now. I feel like maybe we can make them like a tiny, tiny bit harder. I feel like what makes the most difference is uh, like the sprint speed and acceleration. Maybe we can put on 57 and try that. Maybe we will try that for the next episode and just leave everything else the same. But we have definitely recovered. We're in second on 16 points. Chelsea in first on 18. But as you can see, second through fifth, they're all tied on 16 points. So still very early on, but we have recovered from that first episode also goal scoring is looking beautiful Salah with six Firmino with five and Mane with four so that is that is looking perfect those three keep it up we are going to do some damage this season but that is it for this one so if you enjoyed this video drop a like on it subscribe to the channel if you have not and I will see you guys in the next video hope you have a great day